I think on, on in, in E3. Look at it. Go back and look at the, it, 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 it's, uh, our, me just uh, I think on, on in, in E3. So, Jimmy B Gaming did a video about this yesterday, and I want to do a follow-up on it. But before uh, we get into this video, I'm going to say I agree with Jimmy 100% on what he said yesterday. I also have literally seen and heard him say all these things that need to change um, about Xbox ages ago, guys, okay? Anyway, this is the Titanfall Princess, your Irish girl gamer. Let's talk about this Xbox community. Now... My problem with the uh, gaming community is that they fall for stupid shit like Next Gen 720 crying on a live stream about what he uh, brought on himself, okay? He should have been crying a while ago about creating BGST. People like B, uh, Jimmy B Gaming, Black Bond, and Hard Eight Times have been telling Zaire about what he cried about for years and years, okay? Go back, you can find all the videos. They've been talking to him for years about this. This ain't something that happened yesterday. Now, in comparison, it doesn't take me years to see that YouTube uh, Xbox community was full of shit. It didn't. It wouldn't take me being in a corporate slave awards every year, uh, roasted damn near every month, exposed on Twitter damn near every day, um, foot in your uh, mouth every MPD. I'm not even falling for next gen supposedly crying on YouTube over that Phil Spencer dick he used to use as a pacifier since Xbox One was revealed until he's done with frauds like Crap Gamer. Which brings me back to Jimmy B Gaming, who has actually been saying what needs to change about Xbox way back, who has actually played some games with me, who doesn't hide his gamer score or trophies who's actually viewing games with his own footage. And he does all this without lying about the Xbox division. If any of you so-called Xbox YouTubers who talk shit about Sony all the time actually cared about Xbox division, you'd have woke up years ago and been honest about what you got as an Xbox gamer. And what did you get? Overrated garbage ass games like Quantum Break, like ReCore, less games and more controllers. You even got the corporate executives at um, Xbox, like, uh, what's his fucking name? Oh, Aaron Greenberg, um, coming in to rescue with a green hat, green cape and shit, saying crazy shit like um, Xbox has the biggest, biggest exclusives. This is the problem. You have all this going now, but you barely have anyone in the Xbox community calling it out. And when somebody does, you get mad and start crying. So until we start seeing these toxic people like uh, Dealer, Dealer Gaming, like uh, Colt Eastwood, like Live Wires, like Crap Gamer, like Mooch, like uh, Xbox 448, and the rest of these clowns actually be honest about the Xbox division. We are not falling for that stupid soap opera shit. We're not. This is the Titanfall Princess, and I'm out of here. I said my piece.